Linnea Quigley, a seasoned actress renowned for her contributions to the world of cinema, has left an indelible mark on audiences across generations. Whether reminiscing about the first encounter with her work or pondering the defining moments in her extensive career, Quigley's cinematic journey invites reflection. As viewers, we often find ourselves transported through time and genres, contemplating which of her legendary works truly encapsulates the essence of her craft. Each role, be it in horror classics or cult favorites, adds a unique brushstroke to the canvas of her career, prompting the question of which one stands as the quintessential Linnea Quigley performance. While her filmography is a tapestry of memorable characters, the inquiry extends beyond the screen. What personal memories or experiences with this Hollywood luminary have etched themselves into your own narrative? As we navigate the vast landscape of Linnea Quigley's filmography, we invite you to share your cherished moments and stories in the comments below. From that first cinematic encounter to the defining roles that shape her legacy, Linnea Quigley's influence endures, resonating with audiences who have witnessed the breadth of her talent. Join the conversation and contribute your reflections on this iconic figure. What's your most cherished memory or personal experience related to Linnea Quigley? We'd love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Linnea Quigley, an actress with a diverse career, notably starred in three horror films where unsuspecting groups faced unleashed evils, The Return of the Living Dead, Sorority Babes and the Slimeball Bowl o rama and Night of the Demons. Beyond her on-screen roles, Quigley is recognized for her size formidus one divided by two shoe, a distinctive detail that adds a unique touch to her persona. In addition to her contributions to the entertainment industry, Quigley has actively supported PETA campaigns. Notably, she played a role in PETA's Lettuce Ladies campaign, a distinctive initiative where individuals advocate for vegetarian lifestyles adorned solely in lettuce. Her commitment to animal rights extended to the creation of a promotional poster for this campaign. Quigley's involvement in horror cinema, coupled with her personal quirks and advocacy for ethical treatment of animals, underscores a multifaceted personality that extends beyond the silver screen. These facets contribute to an intriguing narrative that goes beyond the typical Hollywood persona. Attending Bettendorf High School in Iowa laid the early foundation for Linnea Quigley's journey from the halls of education to the silver screen. This small town start eventually led to her casting in various cinematic roles, including an intriguing stint in Clive Barker's Lord of Illusions. Despite donning an abstract sculpture crafted by special effects artist Evan Campbell for the role of a demon, Quigley's scenes sadly found their place on the cutting room floor, an unfortunate outcome in the unpredictable world of filmmaking. While her name might not ring a bell for the role of Claudia in Beverly Hills Vamp, she stood as the initial preference for the character, showcasing her prominence even in casting choices. These instances, though divergent, unveil the unpredictability and challenges inherent in an actor's career. Beyond the glitz of Hollywood, Quigley's journey resonates with the highs and lows, from the forgotten scenes to being the first pick for roles that could have shaped her career differently. Such glimpses into Quigley's past shed light on the unpredictable nature of the entertainment industry and the resilience required to navigate its twists and turns. From high school in Iowa to the surreal sets of Clive Barker, Linnea Quigley's story unfolds with unexpected twists, much like the movies she graced. Linnea Quigley, a versatile actress with a journey marked by unexpected turns. Her initial steps into the world of acting were unconventional, starting with a toothpaste commercial. This seemingly mundane beginning laid the groundwork for a career that would later see Quigley in diverse roles, from horror films to surreal sets. While many recognize her for the horror classics like The Return of the Living Dead and Night of the Demons, Quigley's career is punctuated by instances that reflect the unpredictability of the industry. One such moment was her casting as a dancing skeleton in Dead Heat, a scene that, despite its creativity, found its place on the cutting room floor. Interestingly, this unseen footage is available for viewing on Stephen King's World of Horror, providing a glimpse into the behind-the-scenes intricacies of Quigley's work. Not just limited to horror, Quigley's auditions were diverse. She even had the opportunity to audition for the role of Cody in Strip to Kill, but decided to turn it down. These choices, though divergent, showcase the nuances and challenges inherent in an actor's decision-making process. 
From a toothpaste commercial to dancing skeletons and auditioning for various roles, Linnea Quigley's journey is a testament to the unpredictable nature of the entertainment industry. Each twist in her career unveils layers of resilience and decision-making, contributing to a narrative that goes beyond the stereotypical Hollywood story. Auditioning for diverse roles defined Linnea Quigley's career. From a toothpaste commercial to horror classics like The Return of the Living Dead, her journey saw unexpected turns. Notably, she turned down the role of Seal in The Haunting of Morla, showcasing her selective approach. Beyond acting, she reformed her band, The Skirts, in August 2003, performing at Monster Mania and Scream Fest. Quigley's versatility isn't confined to the screen. Her auditions, choices, and musical pursuits contribute to a narrative that goes beyond Hollywood stereotypes. Sharing a birthday with Vincent Price on May 27th adds an intriguing touch to her story, highlighting the coincidences that shape an actor's life. Linnea Quigley's path is a blend of artistic decisions, diverse roles, and a passion for music, creating a unique tapestry in the entertainment industry. Auditioning for roles showcased Linnea Quigley's versatility, extending beyond the horror genre. At Quentin Tarantino's request, she tried out for a supporting role in Reservoir Dogs, a part eventually omitted from the final script. This incident reflects the unpredictable nature of casting in the entertainment industry. Additionally, she declined Eileen Davidson's role in The House on Sorority Row, emphasizing Quigley's selective approach to her career. Beyond the screen, she engages with fans by regularly attending horror conventions, adding a personal touch to her public image. These diverse facets of Quigley's journey, from auditions for iconic films to decisions shaping her roles, contribute to a narrative that goes beyond the expected Hollywood story. Ranked 9 on Maxim's Hottest Women of Horror Movies list, Linnea Quigley stands as a testament to the genre's allure and fascination. Her appeal spans far beyond her roles in iconic horror films like The Return of the Living Dead and Night of the Demons, capturing the essence of her versatile talent and undeniable charisma. Maxim's recognition of her on this list isn't just a nod to her physical attractiveness, it's a validation of her impact and significance within the realm of horror cinema. Quigley's on-screen presence is more than just captivating. It's a magnetic force that draws audiences into her world of frights and screams. Her acknowledgement as one of the hottest women in horror adds an intriguing layer to her narrative, one that transcends the traditional bounds of Hollywood storytelling. It's a testament to her ability to command attention and evoke emotions beyond the scares and thrills of the genre. This ranking is more than a mere number. It's a reflection of Quigley's profound influence on horror aficionados. It showcases the multifaceted aspects that contribute to her enigmatic persona, blending talent, allure, and a distinctive allure that captivates audiences worldwide. Linnea Quigley embodies the essence of horror's allure, leaving an indelible mark on the genre and its fervent fanbase. As our time together draws to a close, I'd like to extend an invitation for introspection. Throughout the vast tapestry of entertainment, certain individuals leave an indelible mark, and Linnea Quigley undeniably stands among them. Perhaps her performances ignited sparks of inspiration within you or transported you to worlds beyond imagination. Your thoughts, cherished memories, or reflections on her craft are invaluable. Sharing those moments can weave a communal fabric of appreciation, fostering a deeper connection beyond the screen. Lydia Quigley's influence on entertainment echoes through the ages, enriching countless lives and shaping the landscape of film and artistry. Her dedication, talent, and the emotive depth she brought to each role reverberate through the hearts of audiences worldwide. Your engagement in celebrating her legacy is a testament to the enduring impact she has had on the world of entertainment. I extend heartfelt gratitude for your time, your sentiments, and your part in commemorating an artist whose brilliance will continue to shine brightly in the realms of cinema. Thank you for joining in this tribute to Linnea Quigley and for sharing your personal connection to her work. It's been an honor to delve into this dialogue with you.